how are we all doing? Welcome to this Enlight tutorial. In this Enlight tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create scrolling text like a ticker tape um, across your image or video or whatever you've got in your timeline. Um, shouldn't take too long. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, select this image and drag that out to, let's say, let's say 10 seconds, right? And you can see in the corner, little right hand corner of my um, main timeline, that if I press and hold this and drag it out, it gives you a little time stamp as to how long that clip now is. So what I'm now going to do, I'm gonna go back and go to text. And this text, if I, let me give you a quick, um, a quick tip with text. If I put my playhead in the center and then select text, it's going to start my text from wherever my playhead is. Okay, so if I want to do it for the duration of my timeline with the ticker tape, in this instance I do, I'm going to select text at the start of my timeline, double tap the text, um, and I'm just going to have the same word scrolling through as we go along. Scrolling text, and that's the word I'm going to use, but in this instance I want it to have a background as well, so the way we are going to do this is we're going to go with the text still selected, I'm going to go to background, I'm going to go to opacity and make that darker and then I'm going to change the colour and in fact I'm going to drag the, let me go back, I'm going to drag the opacity down a bit so we can see the text but um, but the, um, the background is opaque. Double tap the text again so I can edit it, highlight the text, copy I'm then going to deselect that, press space one, five times, and then I'm going to select um, paste, one, two, three, four, done it. So that's my scrolling text, um, copied and pasted. I'm going to put it at the top of the screen, and then I'm going to move my text so it's at the end here. So my scroll is just, um, or my background is just covering the whole of the screen, because that's what I want it to do. And then with my playhead at the start of the timeline, I'm going to click the little diamond, little keyframe button in the start. I'm going to scroll all the way to the end. And because I've got my keyframe button activated, it will automatically put a keyframe in for me then. So then I'm going to scroll to the end of where my text finishes. Depending on how much text you've got over what period will depend how fast it is. And then if I go back, just deselect that and you can see that scrolling text and you could do that with any um, any amount of text. And if you want it to slow down, make the timeline longer. So I'll make it scroll less text over a longer period of time that will slow it down. And if you want to speed it up, um, more text over a shorter period of time. Really simple. Um, hope this um, tutorial helps you out. If you have any questions, give me a shout. I'll catch you all soon. Bye.